Welcome to the Gordon Miller Podcast. On today's podcast episode, I want to talk about Little Caesars Pizza. Yes, Little Caesars Pizza is a very good pizza restaurant. It is excellent tasting, and the price for what you're paying is amazing. The hot and ready deals are good as well. One of my best friends is a chef slash manager at Little Caesars, and he absolutely makes the best pizza. He really puts the time and effort to make the pizza really tasty. And he follows the instructions, and their regional manager even allowed him to uh, doctor it up with a different variation. Now, does this go against uh, the policy? Well, if the regional manager got permission from all the way to the top to say, well, you can add a little more pepperoni if you need to add more pepperoni. And uh, my friend was pretty excited about that because he is a one of the best managers slash chefs at Little Caesars. I think he's the best. And he's able to... Uh, he really likes it when people are happy. He likes it when the people give him compliments and they really he really likes it when the customers come back to him and say, "Look, this is one of the best pizzas I've had here at Little Caesars and I want to thank you because he to my friend, it's not about the money, it's about the inner satisfaction, the satisfaction that he it it brings to him he uh, really likes the fact that, uh, you know, he gets an inner satisfaction. It, it brings comfort and joy to his heart. And he really is happy when the customers say, I want to speak to this chef slash manager. And the, he truly uh, loves it when he gets compliments for his amazing chef skills and managing skills too. He's been there a long time at Little Caesars. Little Caesars now is one of the best pizza places, I say, because, again, you're paying for a pizza that they make it so wonderful. It's wonderfully tasting. The pizza there is underrated, I think. They also have crazy bread, and they even have cheesy bread that is really quite underrated and it's really great very tasty food at little caesar's restaurant now that's one thing i wish little caesar's would have is a buffet they should start their own buffet and it would be uh it would be great i even uh brought this to my ma uh, manager slash chef friend, he, my friend that's a manager slash chef for Little Caesars Pizza, he said, you know, that would be a really interesting idea. It would be one of those ideas that would probably do really well. But at this point in the Little Caesars franchise, are they able to afford this? I said that to my friend and he, would, he, he replied back, that's a very good point, Gordon. I would like to know why the uh, managers or why the, uh, the franchise doesn't start a buffet. And maybe you know that there's a place in, uh, in America somewhere where there is a buffet for Little Caesars restaurant. Now, Little Caesars restaurant is amazing. It has even... They have even when that pepperoni, it's it's uh, it's very tasty. The bread is very tasty, and that's what a lot of things. If you look at uh, the uh, other restaurant places, of, of the other pizza restaurant places, they just uh, you pay for what you get at Little Caesars, and it's but you don't even get you actually you get more for what you pay for at Little Caesars. 
a lot of places, a lot of other pizza places, they just don't have the, 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 well, the, the overall taste, the overall taste for what you pay for. And it, it's, you get your bang for your buck. That is a figure of speech. I don't know if you ever heard of that, but there is a saying that says you get your bang for your buck, which means you get more. And that's what Little Caesars is, is more. It's, it's more tasty, uh, a more better pizza than a lot of pizza places. Now, is it the best pizza? Well, that is open for debate, but it's up there. It is really quite flavorful and very quite tasty. My friend, who's the manager at Little Caesars, and he's also a chef. He may, he prepares the dough, he prepares the bread, he does good stuff. And he, uh, like I say, he really is happy when the customers at Little Caesars thank him. And I don't blame him. It would be one of those jobs where it would be quite interesting to work at because it's not about uh, it's not about the money. It would be about making the customers happy and and hoping hoping they enjoy their uh, slices of pizza, their bread, their crazy bread, their uh, cheese bread, and they even have wings there at pizza or at Little Caesars Pizza Restaurant. I don't know if you ever been to Little Caesars Restaurant. But I highly recommend it because Little Caesars Pizza Restaurant is a very wonderful place to go and get it. I haven't been there for a long time, and I really need to uh, try that out. I think my friend would be even happy if I was able to try the pizza there at Little Caesars Restaurant. Little Caesars Pizza Restaurant. And uh, it would be... it would. It would behoove you. Now, that's another figure of speech. Behoove. I don't know if you ever heard of that, but behoove, a behoove you to do. It would it benefit you to uh, try Little Caesar's Pizza out. Little Caesar's is quite the dish of amazement. Uh, you would be uh, really happy if you ate at Little Caesar's Pizza Restaurant. Well, not actually at there, because I don't know if they have a sit-down place. I know some places actually have, like, you can go outside and they have a little picnic table where you could sit at and eat your Little Caesars pizza. And perhaps you had crazy bread, perhaps you had uh, the cheese bread. But it is wonderful, wonderful dish of uh, excellence, especially if you can get a good chef there at Little Caesars that makes your pizza wonderful. And if it tastes wonderful, you'll be really happy. But make sure to thank your pizza chef, your pizza chef at Little Caesars. They really greatly appreciate the compliment for thanking them for the excellent, amazing, very tasty pizza that is excellent. Thank you very much for listening to the Gordon Miller Podcast. I have, have a great day.